Hey guys, I got another application for you. It is not new, but it is the brand new update, and the application is AnyRing. If you haven't heard of it before, it is from the Rock app, but um, with this, I will put the deb in the description, and then you will not need any of the Rock app extensions or the application itself. Okay, so once you open it, just click Enable, and then there's a couple other features you can have vibrate. Um, and what this does is you can pick any song from your library to use as your ringtone or SMS tone. And you can set it to last however long you want. Um, you can also record your own, like if you just want your voice saying text message or something, whatever. There you go, you can make your own. So I would just make a default SMS. And then you can also choose it to do for both or just one, whatever. Um, you can choose it to loop and you can change the volume. So I'll just put it about 75%. And like I said, you can choose it from any point in the song. Um, so I just picked out a song already, uh, T.I.'s new song, and I'll let you listen to it. It matters not how many times you fall down. And then that is what my ringtone is. So you just close out of the application. As you see, it will do that. Once it reboots, or respring's, I should say, um, whenever you get a text message or a ringtone, that will come up. Let me show you here. All right, so I'll just send myself a text message. Hopefully you guys heard that. Um, you can set it for SMS, ringtone, whatever. Um, it's a pretty cool app if you don't like the regular um, tones that are on here. If you don't have any custom ones and you want something from your iPod and you don't feel like making it from your computer, just use this application. Um, so yeah, you don't have to have Rock App, which is amazing because I hate that and I'm sure a lot of you do. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video.